Canada has a very brief history of being independent because they're weak. Imagine being, <laughs> imagine being run by the French. Anyway, uh, they do wear a specific type of armor that I'm willing to test today. It's known as the jean jacket. So what I'm doing is taking layers of denim. I've got several of them, and I'm going to see how many of these layers it takes to stop a bullet. We'll be starting with the 22 out of a Ruger 1022, uh, and we will be using this here pumpkin as our target behind. And uh, essentially, we'll just move up in layers of 10 until it stops a bullet. Yep. Okay. So we will be shooting at the target from about 25 yards, and then we will increase layers of denim by 10 until it stops a bullet. All right. Let's go see if it made it through 10 layers of denim. Okay, here's our target. Went through. Went through. Uh, yeah. So 10 is not enough. So if you're wearing 10 Canadian tuxedos, you're still not safe. So let's add 10 more and see how it goes. 22, or wait, 20 layers of denim, right? Yep. <laughs> Okay, 20 layers. Let's see. Yep. You're dead. Well, let's increase by 20 this time. So we'll say 22. So we need 8 to make it 30. I lied. <laughs> 30 layers of denim. Let's see how it goes. Almost certain that went through. Yep. All the way through. 30 layers. Golly, okay. So we're just going to move up to 50. 50 layers of denim and see if that stops it. The pumpkin is officially wearing more denim than any man ever should, but 50 layers of denim, 25 yards, 22 LR. Obvious entry. See, I think I might be... No, it's going through all of them. I was going to say, I might be missing a few layers. Maybe if I try at the thickest point. Let's just throw them all on there. So, 74 layers. That's all I got. If 74 doesn't stop it, well then, boy. Nothing. Exactly. Canadians are in a lot of trouble. We're 74 layers deep, and it is going right through. And I mean, it's not even slowing it down to stop it from coming out the ass into the pumpkin. So when people say that 22 sucks or whatever, keep this in mind. You could line up so many jean jackets, so many jean jackets, and you'd still have penetration. So we're going to try to fold them up more and see if we can double the layers. Now we got something truly ridiculous going on. But 148 layers of denim at 25 yards, 22 LR, 40 grain. Hope for the best. Okay. Entry. And we'll... Oh, I think it stopped it. Oh, cool. Okay. Hang on. Let me put this on the table. And we'll count through until we find the projectile. Entry. That's two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighty, eighty-one, eighty-two. No, no, no. I was at eighty something else. I'll have to review the tape, but essentially this is. 88 here, and then there's our guy. See that? So, 91, 92, 93, 94. Still going because it went through that. 
95. So 95 layers of denim to stop a 22 LR. Look at that. Fuck yeah. <laughs> so roughly 95 layers of denim to stop a 22 LR. Um, I was going to do 9 millimeter. It kind of seems like a waste though. Like, We'll just jump up to a very, very ridiculous caliber and see if we could stop it with denim. That should be fun. 50 Action Express at a very close distance. We'll see if denim can stop it. I don't think it can. Terrific. Okay, so it seems I was able to hit the denim, uh, but it kind of blew it all over the place. I blew it. Uh, I'll never find that projectile. Oh, that's why. <laughs> so it did not stop. Yeah, I don't think it matters how many layers of this. Maybe if you had like several feet of denim, it would work. Anyway. I appreciate your time as always. And now we have a conclusion real quick before I let you go. 95 to 100 layers of denim will stop a 22. Canadians, you got to pick a better armor. Thank you for your time, of course, and God bless the great state of Texas.